On the second day of Christmas, my true love. <laughs> oh, y'all don't, oh, don't really want to hear me sing? Oh, okay. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. I'm Julia. Friends call me J-Rock. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. You are the real MVP. So today we're getting into the second day of sneakers or the second day of Christmas sneakers. I'm gonna I'm have to figure out what to call it so that we're not guessing the next 10 days after this. So without further ado, let's get into day two. Since I wear grade school sizes, the box is pretty unassuming. Our second shoe is the Air Jordan 14 Hyper Royal. I believe these dropped in September of this year. And uh, this is my very first and only pair of 14s. Um, there are other ones that have come out that they were okay, but I really wasn't sold on them at all. Like, I know that people talk about the Ferrari 14s and this 14 and that 14. Some of them, I don't think they even came out in grade school, but that's a separate conversation. But honestly, this, this besides the Carolina Blue 14s, this is the only one that really, really spoke to me. And the Carolina Blue 14s, you know, just forget it. So these, um, because if you've watched my channel long enough, you know that my favorite color is blue. So obviously this sneaker has, has that in there. Um, and I just really liked it because I think it was simpler than some of the other 14s that came out. I'm not a big fan of the whole upper being um, being one color. So like the Ferrari 14s with the with the red, the full red on the upper and all of that. I don't know if that's really something that I would rock personally, but because this this shoe really just encompasses the colors that I wear all the time. Behind blue, black is my favorite color. And obviously you can't go wrong with a with a mostly white um, upper sneaker. Um, I mean, you guys have seen this, so I will just show it to you guys real, real quick. Just spin it so that you can see it. Um, if you watched my video yesterday, you know that I'm not doing anybody's full unboxing. Again, you guys have seen these. But uh, like I said, I really, this is my only pair of 14s. And I'm okay with that because 14s are not my, are really not one of my favorite silhouettes. Uh, like I said, some of the other ones just didn't speak to me. But these, especially because of the blue accents, um, you know, got the shark teeth or whatever they call these right here, uh, got those on the midsole that really, really stood out from the rest of the shoe. Because without it, it really would have just been a plain, mostly white and black sneaker. So having a little accent of blue um, on the midsole, again, on the on the back of the heel or on the back of the shoe here. Um, and then you also have the blue on the on the tongue. It's like, it's subtle hints of blue in this sneaker that make it like not overpowering, but it still just gives me just enough blue to get, forgive my blue fix. The top 10 in my closet, no, but it's definitely one of my favorite pickups this year. And the other thing I like about this sneaker is because of the, the colors are so simple, you can wear it with just about anything. I mean, for me, I, I wear the same thing all the time, black and blue mostly, but you know, for, for anyone else, I mean, because the sneaker is so simple, you really can just wear it with, with just about anything. But yeah, won't keep you guys too long on day two. Uh, let me know, did you pick this sneaker up when it dropped? What do you think of it? Do you have other 14s in your closet that you like? You know, drop me a comment below and show me a little bit of love. But before I get out of here, this is the Air Jordan 14 Hyper Royal for the second day of sneakers. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is J-Rock and I'm out.